Cybertron. A planet finally at peace after millions of years of war. The Council of Worlds, led by Rodimus Prime, Starscream, and Mistress of Flame, ushered in a new era of hope and prosperity. But peace was threatened as the Combiners rose to battle each other, causing planet-wide destruction. To combat the brutal Combiner Wars, the Council considered using the Enigma of Combination, a mysterious and ancient artifact that possesses the power to merge Transformers into massive robots. After losing her friend to the evil Combiner, Menasaur, Windblade plotted to destroy the Enigma. Help me! The Combiners can't be controlled! Optimus Prime returned from exile to join Windblade and a reluctant ally, Megatron, to confront the Council. Ha! I'm in. But they were too late. We have to use the Enigma! Starscream seized the opportunity to use the Enigma for his own devious agenda. Once in control of the artifact, he transformed himself into the ultimate Combiner. However, the unstable side effects of the Enigma turned him into an uncontrollable monster. Only when Windblade rediscovered her connection to the Titan Metroplex and former rivals teamed up, Cybertron was saved from Armageddon. Peace is briefly restored, but the Transformers are about to discover that Starscream's actions were part of a far more dangerous threat. The Titans have returned. Welcome to stay with us, Optimus Prime. Help us rebuild. Thank you, Mistress. But I have already overstayed my welcome. We apologize for not trusting you earlier. We should have known Starscream would never change, and that his hunger for power would lead us to this. Starscream is dead now. Do not let his actions weigh on your conscience. Reconsider your departure. Remain and take your rightful place with us in the Council. It is best if I do not. My ways are the old ways. For when we warred with the Decepticons, I must lead the rebuilding of Cybertron to you, as I promised I would. Consider another for the Council. I have long believed Perceptor would- Perceptor? He is no fighter, no leader. Optimus Prime, do not leave us now. You're peeling out? How can you? Windblade. But we're a team. You are already part of the team. Uh, huh? huh?
Speaker, your partnership with the Titan makes you a formidable force. Yeah, well, nice working with you. She is young. She will... learn. Yes, and that is a good thing. We see your mind will not be changed. I will go to the Primal Basilica and will pray to the original Thirteen to guide and watch over you, my friend. Farewell, Mistress of Flame. Storm Clash, all clear. I am carrying the Matrix of Leadership. bearer of the Matrix of Leadership seeks the wise counsel of his fellow primes. The combined wisdom of your predecessors welcomes you, Rodimus Prime. How may we be of service? I need a favor. I thought I had the strength to carry the Matrix of Leadership. But I don't feel that way anymore. Explain. I use poor judgment. My ego got in the way didn't see the threat Starscream posed. I must give back the Matrix of Leadership. The Matrix is a symbol of worthiness, not infallibility. You have performed your duties admirably. Let your self-doubt pass. I appreciate your confidence, but better the Matrix go to someone who wants it. I just want to go back to who I was. Maybe with a few small upgrades? Farewell, Rodimus 
who was once prime. The name's Hot Rock. Scepter? Is that you? Why are you scoping out Starscream? He's fascinating. He's dead. Hmm? Oh, yes, that's true. But the composition of his hull... There's something very different. I wonder if the Enigma of Combination somehow permanently altered his molecular structure. I have to take a sample. This demands further analysis. Gee, sounds like a party. Have fun with that. I don't understand Perceptor. He's so... What's that? Did you say something? Weird. I could have sworn I heard... Metroplex. We shouldn't be communing now. I have to see if I can find whatever was making that sound I heard. Wait. All of your systems. Your spark. You were gonna leave Cybertron. But I... I don't understand. The purpose of the original Titans is to carry Cybertronian life across the stars. Each Titan chooses a habitable planet, then becomes a city center from which life adapts and reproduces. Once life takes hold, Titans sleep in their city form until it is their time to depart and start the cycle anew. My time arrived, but I want to see Starscream's abuse of the Enigma of Combination. Starscream's actions very well may have set this world on a course of ultimate destruction. I might not be able to alter that course, but I must try. Wait, wait! You're too badly damaged! You'll be destroyed! Metroplex! I was forged to help advance our species, but I also swore an oath to Optimus Prime that I would defend our species to my last astrosecond. I cannot abandon the life I helped grow. Leave me now. I must repair what I can in 
the little time I had. Metroplex? <gasps> oh, scrud! Metroplex! Metroplex! So glad you're here. I can't wait to share what I found. Aren't there any fighters around? I've been studying a unique atom I noticed in the molecular structure of Starscream's corpse. And my studies have yielded an interesting result. But take a look. But take a look, take a look. Fine, fine. If it'll get you to listen sooner. The atom, which radiates an energy I have yet to identify, is old. By that, I mean it shows no sign of decay. Nor does it appear to have ever undergone any kind of decay. It could conceivably be billions of years old. Okay, I looked. Now listen. Given that the atom came from the Enigma of Combination, that opens the possibility, the probability, that the Enigma is older than the Primes themselves. Ugh. What in the name of Red Alert's Lawn's Daylight samples is going on out there? It's what I've been trying to tell you. Trypticon? Another Titan has awakened? But how? Why? Forget that. We need all hands on deck. Who's around? Mistress of Flame. Not optimal, but I guess she'll do for a start. Come on! Wait! Wait! I'm really more suited to a lab, not a battlefield! Perceptor, we want to know what is creating these damnable tremors. It's an old Decepticon battle station called Trypticon, and it's tearing the city apart. By the original 13. Hmm, it's really quite remarkable. Statistically, a second Titan awakening so close to the first is highly unlikely. There must be some common causality for these occurrences. A second Titan. That's what we need to combat Trypticon. Windblade, will Metroplex save us once more? He is going to try. But he shouldn't. Trypticon will pulverize him. We have to find other fighters and tell Metroplex to stand down. I am summoning the Elite Air Resistance Squadron. If they do not succeed in driving Trypticon off, and if your Titan partner is as damaged as you say, then there may be no hope for Metroplex City. Cybertronian citizens, as I have done before, I will battle Trypticon again. Remove yourselves to safety. No chance. Where you go, I go. Forgive me, Mistress, but there may be another option besides Metroplex and the Air Defense Squadron. Really, Perceptor? Perhaps you know of another Titan who happens to be lying around? Actually, yes. Fortress Maximus. Who? He was built during the Great War and decommissioned shortly thereafter. He's been dormant ever since. Do you know where to find this Fortress Maximus? I'm sorry, Mistress, I don't. But Computron should be able to access historical battle journals and find him.
Then we will send Computron and the other Combiners to the Titan's location to try to rouse him. And if they can't? Hmm. I am not a military strategist. But I know someone who is. What's up, Mistress? Rodimus Prime. You sound different. Yeah. That'll happen when you don't have to lug around the Matrix of Leadership. Call me Hot Rod. Well, but where is the Matrix? Back with you, Primal Basilica. Blasphemy! How dare you do this without consulting anyone? Cybertron needs the wisdom of the Matrix. Trypticon has returned! Scrap a dipstick. Trypticon. That's gonna be bad for someone. Metroplex has deployed himself. You won't be enough. Alright, I'll think of something. I'll think of something? Do you have a plan? I figure I'll show up, see what happens. Did he suggest a course of action? Not exactly. The elites. seems to be at full strength. You don't have to do this. I must. I will protect Cybertrovian life, as is my duty. You don't have to prove anything. You're too beat up. It's going to fall! 
Have faith, Perceptor. I'll put my faith in structural dynamics. This building is going over. It appears our faith has been rewarded. Your faith, at least. I wasn't forged for this. Metroplex, disengage! You can't win this hand to hand! Activate the Primal Basilica's defense system. I'll go immediately. If you need me, I'll be in the prayer chamber. Why? If we're to survive, we're going to need a miracle. for killing you. This battle is not like the ones you and I have always fought. No kidding. Those were the days, right? Anyway, you're always so dramatic. <sighs> I'm sure someone will do something and this will all work itself out somehow. I am serious. Of course you are. You're always serious. But now you've got me curious. What else is bothering the great Optimus Prime? Aside from the obvious, that is. This is the beginning of the end. We have never known this level of chaos. First, 
the Combiners were out of control. Now, the Titans have awoken and will level cities with their compact. Perhaps our species has run its course. If we do not utterly destroy ourselves, the gods will one day end it for us. You mean the original 13? You've gotten paranoid in your old age, Optimus. They're not gods. They're no greater than us. In fact, I'm half convinced they're just old legends. They are coming. Really? So now you're a soothsayer? I once possessed the Matrix of Leadership. It contained within it the wisdom of all the Autobot leaders before me. And now, the Matrix has spoken to me once again. Not just of itself, the Requiem Blaster, and the Enigma of Combination. Those ancient relics, they were meant for the days when Unicron needed to be brought down. The gods will soon walk amongst us again. Oh my, Optimus. You're worse off than I ever imagined. I don't know why I'm even bothering to talk to you. Megatron. Oh, what is it now? Goodbye. <laughs> You're precious. thousand metacycles. I just hope I can get it rebooted in time. Victorion to Mistress of Play. If you are receiving me, Computron has led us to Fortress Maximus. The fortress appears inert, as surmised. We're beginning our scan now. Salvation. Or our ultimate doom. Oh, great Primus, our father of sparks, please guide our prayers so that we may find the wisdom of one of your 13 children, Sentinel Prime. Grant us this wisdom to understand the plans of the 13, the Holy Ones who came before us and guide our destinies. Our need is desperate, and we beseech you, for the Titans have risen anew, and we know not why. Give us the clarity of Alchemist, the dreams of Quintus, the sageliness of Alpha Trion, 
Grant us the fluidity of Amalgamus, the kindness of Solus, and the strength and light of Prima, the one who leads us all. Megatron? Nope. Not Megatron. Something a whole lot better. You have not been invited to these most sacred chambers. How did you get- <laughs> Sorry, I had to do that, your mistress. I don't need your permission to go anywhere. I'm overlord. Hi. <sighs> Careful. Those who forget the past are doomed to repeat it, right? Now nah, you're catching up. It is. So I've been watching all. Cause, you know, I do love a good fight. Uh. And so it appears to you. Uh. Oof. You all really wrecked this place, didn't you? I'll bet you lose your security deposit. For you. Yeah. Because all of this societal, political, religious mumbo jumbo, <laughs> it's for the junkers. Hey, did I see Devastator and Victorion fighting around here a little while ago? You see, I was a ways away, so it was hard to tell. And then there was all this lightning and noise. And call me crazy, but did I see a giant star scream in there too? I mean, what was that all about? So of course, I had to come and get a closer look. And no sooner do I get closer than I see Metroplexes up and around too. <laughs> How old is that guy? Right? Just what's he up to? are rapidly failing. This battle is lost. You're gonna use my power. To what end? Cut that chat! Priestesses and uh, politicianesses. 
You're not very convincing as a fighter. Do not underestimate me. Yes, ma'am. I promise to give you all the respect you deserve. <laughs> Report your findings. Datum, Fortress Maximus retains both his short and long range missiles, but his transformation cog is non functional. Who cares? We fight Trypticon! I don't need missiles! Missiles, you say? Are the coordinates of Trypticon locked in? Affirmative. Hey, wait. Ain't Metroplex still fighting Trypticon? He will not last. That is a foregone conclusion. I have always known it would be we combiners who saved the galaxy, not the Titans. But this is still a heavy decision for me. Don't we get to do any of the deciding? Forgive me, valiant Metroplex. This is for the good of us all. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, hey. So, 
I think you're, um, okay, what happened to Rodimus Prime? Permanent vacation. Whatever, glad you're here. Do you have any idea how it is Metroplex can suddenly shoot flames from his eyes? I might. I'm going closer to see if I'm right. Stay out of range, kid. Kid? Metroplex, I'll give that 40-story robo-lizard something else to think about. Metroplex, we don't have the power. Can you hang on until... There is no time, Emissary. You must leave me while you can. Damn it! Nothing you can do. Ugh. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Huh? Get clear! Something's happening! It's a Titan Master! Move it, Light Sled! Move it! Kid, this is gonna get a lot worse. How is that even possible? No, no, no! Make tracks! Crypticon can do that now? Titan Masters transfer their abilities to their hosts. Emissary gets plugged in, Crypticon breathes fire. Obey me, creature! No! Mistress of Flame, before you redline your temperature gauge, I'm only here to talk about one of your favorite topics. Religion. Well, I suppose I should bow my cab and say a few nice words. But who am I kidding? Megatron? It's me, Mistress. Victorion and the Combiners. Did they awaken... Fortress Maximus? I don't know anything about that. Who did this to you? Overlord. Overlord. 
Overlord. That bot's back. Not hard to guess why, after the last beating I gave him. Still, he's got a rotten sense of timing. As I'm sure you'd agree. Chances that destroy Trypticon? Not good. Where are you going? I'm gonna get that Titan Master out of Trypticon. All by yourself? Trypticon just took 20 missiles to the grill. We can't beat him. No, but Fortress Maximus can. An emissary is the key. Okay, so what's our plan? Uh, our plan? And you just hang here and set up the victory parade. Oh, like he doesn't put his wheels on one tire at a time like the rest of us. Think of a plan. Think of a plan. Okay, Windblade. If you're coming along, I need a favor. No, I will not paint your portrait at your moment of triumph. Throttle back. I just need a distraction. That I can do. <sighs> Windblade! Go ahead! Get ready for a mid-air rescue! We'll be coming out of a different opening! Which one? Not sure. But I'm really hoping it's above the waist. Scrud. There's not enough time for me to get to you. You don't need time. You just need him. Okay, how damaged are you? Just get Emissary to Fortress Maximus and do whatever it takes to wake that Titan up. All right, all right, we're going. But I'm sending for Ratchet to patch you up. Yeah, I'll pick you up on that. Now get out of here. We weren't formally introduced. I'm- Windblade, city speaker. We Titan Masters have heard about you. Really? Well, ain't I a fan favorite? Chair overboard, but uh. Oh, that's okay, thanks. I've been sitting most of the day anyway. Come to pick over the scraps? Not a lot of pleasure in offing someone who can't fight back. Well, not for you. Suck my exhaust pipe. Do what? Kick your hatchback? 
No, no, no. I'm not here to fight you, boy. There's just something I'd like you to carry. And then, I'm gonna watch the sparks fly. Literally. <laughs> huh? Yeah. This ought to put some paint on your hood. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Yeah, that's what I said, right? And I was gonna ask the same thing. We shall return to Metroplex City, either to finish the battle or help the survivors. Don't waste your time. Metroplex City is a lost cause. Megatron, combiners, two arms. Do not give this vile, traitorous fuse box a chance to sway us with his honeyed words. I'm not here to sway, or fight for that matter. I came here for answers, religious type answers. And since the Mistress of Flame is dead, you're the next best resource. The Mistress of Flame is dead? Assassin! Huh? Oh, Statements, God. past falsehoods indicate probable current dishonesty. Listen to me, you dim sparks. I didn't kill the Mistress. Mistress of Flame. <gasps> Mistress of Flame. What happened? Murder. She's dead? But the Mistress of Flame doesn't just die. We need her. Trypticon will destroy the city if we don't fight with every Autobot we have. Optimus Prime, she can't be dead. Calm yourself, Preceptor. Who did this to the mistress? Unknown. But she gave them a tremendous fight. The killer left no paint flex. Whoever did this is an experienced killer. It is a mystery that will have to wait. Terrible as the mistress's fate is, there are more urgent matters to attend to. What are you doing here, anyway? I was summoned. Summoned? By whom? Did the Mistress reach out to you? Or Hot Rod? Hot Rod? If he is no longer Rodimus Prime, that would explain why I was summoned to the Basilica. What are you doing? Activating the Basilica's defenses. The Mistress considered that, but they're too weak to stop Triptychal. Yes, but they will delay him. At least for a time. If you're delaying Trypticon, that must mean you have some plan you need time to enact. Optimus, did the Matrix of Leadership summon you? Indeed. One who once bore the Matrix of Leadership seeks the wisdom of those who came before him. 
The combined wisdom of your predecessors welcomes you, Optimus Prime. How may we be of service? I seek to reclaim that which is all of ours, and what was once mine. Mistress of Flame! Observation! Megatron has not proven trustworthy for the last 14,281 cycles! When have you ever told the truth, fiend? Well, now for one cycle. Oh. I will cut you from hood ornament to rear spoiler! Good luck with that. your evil exists to be extinguished! What the headlight are you junk piles doing? Trypticon's running wild back in the city! And Megatron? Why are you even here? Let's just say I have reason to believe that our... problems are more than just a loose titan. And I really didn't kill Mistress of Flame, by the way. Demand. Name Mistress of Flame's killer. Who did this to you? Overlord. Why didn't you show us this before? I didn't exactly have a free second before a sword was thrown at my head. The Combiner shall return to the city. And destroy the murdering scum! Oh, yeah! Huh? Wait. Before you go, I have to know something. The Enigma of Combination has been found. And now the Titans are returning. Nothing can stop them all. Is this the beginning of the end? Perhaps, Megatron. You are finally seeing the light that lies beyond control through tyranny. As for whether these are the end times, I do not know. I also suspect forces unseen. But I only follow the will of the original Combiner, Nexus Prime. So far, he has not whispered anything to me. If you want answers, perhaps you should speak to the one you worship. Let us depart to seek vengeance and triumph, friends. Not us. We're not going. We need to get Fortress Maximus up and running. So be it. If we Combiners must fight alone, we shall. Ah, uh, won't be enough. Perhaps you are right. But as children of Nexus Prime, we should be able to harness his gift in a way Starscream could not. Uh, should? It has never been tried before. But our cause and cogs are pure. Attend me, Combiners! impressive.
So how does this work? I've tried waking Fortress Maximus, but I can't access his mind. But with you... I don't like the lack of certainty in that statement. With any procedure, there's always a slight possibility of something going wrong. How slight a possibility? Maybe two and three? Two and three? You got a better option? Well, don't look at me. I guess this is the only choice. Let's do this. Good soldier. <laughs> On my mark. We'd almost forgotten about you. Vengeance will keep. Your threat demands immediate and righteous action.
I'd prefer peace as well. I wouldn't be asking you to fight if it weren't absolutely necessary. I am to renounce my commitment to peace and simply take the word of one to whom I have never before spoken? Yes. I am a city speaker chosen to speak to the Titans, and I am calling upon you. Cybertron needs you, Fortress Maximus. You must help. Never do that again. Now what? It's happening! Are you sure? No. Or maybe... Yeah! say. I'm glad the Matrix of Leadership is back where it belongs. I feel much better knowing you're in charge. I will not be keeping the Matrix, Perceptor. Excuse me? You will be. You want to give it to me? Come with me. I believe that for some reason, Triptychon is after the Matrix of Leadership. But... why? What would he do with it? I do not know, but we must protect the Matrix at all costs. Then aren't you the best qualified for that? Against Triptychon? That would be a fight that even I cannot win. But... but... what am I supposed to do with it? Run, Perceptor before our enemies realize what has happened. And then? Only the leaders of Cybertron can decide then, my friend. But what will you... All right. I won't fail you. I mean, I won't fail Cybertron.
Fly? Sorry. Of course I had to. Windblade? You might want to bank around. Why? This is the good part. Ain't he a beauty? Wow. visual on Metroplex City. The combat there continues. The destruction is catastrophic. Who's fighting? Can you see? Triptychon and Victorion, though she appears to be much bigger. Who's winning? Triptychon. The Victorian combiner is badly damaged and on the verge of defeat. I also see Metroplex, who appears to be non-functional. He fought bravely. He was the bravest of us. But if he could not defeat Triptychon... You? Nervous? Not what I would have expected from a Titan. I am not a fighter by nature. Well, today, you fight. You need not remind me of my duty. But it is no crime to wish there were a more peaceful solution. Right now, that's not an option. We won't force you. 
But we woke you because we need your help. I am prepared, City Speaker. My purpose is to protect Cybertron to the last glimmer of my spark. Optimus Prime, Trypticon is not truly the enemy. But he will destroy everything. He must be stopped. Beware the power of the Primes. What does that mean? Do not sit by while others fight for them. But we cannot aid Optimus Prime in this damaged form. Combiners! Let none withstand our righteous thunder! Can we just fight? Menasaur finally said something smart! Statement. This unit concurs with previous two statements. Fine. Trypticon, cease this destruction, or we will be forced to tear you apart! Good plan! The Energon mains running beneath the city! I will calculate the point of lowest structural integrity for Trypticon's lower stabilizer, and you will strike it with maximum force. Okay. There. Okay. Well, that didn't work! Compiling. Come on, come on! Directive, pursue and repeat previous actions. Okay! I will not separate!
Kid, Crypticon is transforming to its fortress mode. Okay, now what? Roll out and attack from all sides. Agreed. We can fell him if we strike in unison. Relax. You're in good hands. Fortress Maximus, awake. Windblade, you succeeded. With a little help. And a lot of pain. to safety. I will see you to Tritacon. I'm gonna boost Fortress Maximus. We will help and launch our own attack. Victorian, can you recreate your combined form? Uh... Unfortunately, no. Our energies are depleted from our last transformation. Then our strategy is to distract him. Separate and execute flanking maneuvers. Megatron! Maximus! I'm here to help! No, Emissary. Should I fall, 
You must remain to seek out other titans to take my place. Down in front, I can't see the battle. You cannot remain an observer in this struggle. Well, we both know this isn't the real struggle. So you believe me now? I'm maintaining a wait-and-see attitude. But while you wait, lives could be lost. Understand. It's so much worse than that. What do you mean? Triptychon swallowed Victorion, and Victorion has the Enigma of Combination. Starscream's armor. But that's impossible. What? Yes, I understand. It is written. But I don't think I should be the one to... To them. Mind control. What little processors Devastator and Menasaur had? They belong to Triptychon now. We need to get them off Fortress Maximus. without him. Yes, you're doing a great job so far.
This is ridiculous. Please, this is your fight too. How do you figure? This is about all of Cybertron. If it dies, you die. Hmm, I'm hardly sentimental about this ball of dirt and circuits. Then because I'm asking you. That's it. Out of the kindness of my spark. Yes. Well, I don't have any kindness in my spark. But amusement, that I have. And because you've amused me, sure, I'll help, why not? But if we get through this, you owe me. Whatever. for you. I just want to see what's really behind all this. Somebody explain what just happened. The Matrix of Leadership. Its power can only be accessed by the Chosen. Which is what we were counting on. We? It is not over. Stand your ground, allies. Starscream, Lords of Tarn, can't 
you ever just stay dead? Dead? Fortress Maximus. Greater forces are at play here, and we are all pawns to their machinations. of your name as a symbol, a symbol of the empire you sought to build. I bore the weight of the mission that you began. I ruled planets, commanded armies, fought so many wars in your name. You are acknowledged. Now make your point. We lost, God damn you! I've been banished, stripped of my title, and abandoned by my troops. You claim to be our god, but what have you done for us? More importantly, what are you going to do for me? <laughs> Fortress Maximus, now! Good. Because 
I have not come here to play with you. I come for these, divine design. Enjoy your final days, Transformers, because in the end, no sentient being lasts forever. Well, almost no sentient being. <laughs> Megatron, what was that all about? You want to bring back the Decepticons? State your intent, villain! Don't you have anything to say for yourself, Megatron? Will you all please just shut up? I'm trying to think. Of what? Ways to destroy us? I knew there could be nothing good in you! I will rip you- I'm not trying to start the Decepticons again. But we all saw you! You begged Megatronus to put you back in charge. I was stalling for time, you idiot. How do you think Optimus and Fortress Maximus had time to attack? And now, Optimus Prime is dead. Well, that's not my fault. Can we just kill him already? I can't believe I'm saying this, but I'm with Menasaur. Okay, to be honest. I was hedging my bets. I thought the fight could go either way. But it seems Megatronus is far more powerful than all of us. And seeing as he wants us all dead, I suppose we're all on the same team now. You're joking. Don't worry. I know where Megatronus is going. We will not listen to any more of your lies, deceiver! Hold it just a minute. Tell us where you think Megatronus is going. The question isn't where, Perceptor. The question is, will you all follow me there? Downright interesting. Wouldn't you say so?